When we are young, our idea of peace means nothing more than a state of harmony. And harmony in the eyes of a child can be drawn as a butterfly, rainbow, or heart. Each of these things are used to bring a smile to someone's face, to help a friend that's having a bad day, and to bring peace into an unhappy environment. The powerful tools we use to create peace when we are still small consist of a mere crayon, a piece of paper, and sometimes a touch of glitter. So what does peace mean to us when we are young, and how do we explain it? Well, peace can be as simple as drawing a picture on a blank piece of paper. Peace is friendship, peace is love, and peace is kindness. But what does peace mean to us when we grow older? When we grow older, our understanding of the world changes, and we are exposed to problems we never thought could exist when we were a child. The word peace starts to mean a stress-free state of security and calmness. It comes where there is no fighting or war. That all nations live in harmony and have a sense of happiness and freedom. Everybody accepts one another despite the diverse cultures, religions and ethnicities that individuals belong to. And this peace that we yearn for can only present itself when we allow ourselves to be willing to speak about uncomfortable subjects. We will only find peace within ourselves, our schools and our communities when we learn not to be oblivious to these issues. Because an issue is only an issue if we refuse to find a solution. Peace comes from forgiveness and learning from the past. We do not know what the future holds, but we do know who holds the future. So what does peace mean to us? Peace is the future.